Hold on, this is interesting. I just started up the game and we already have blood on our character, apparently. Okay, that's interesting. So as you may have already been able to tell, I tried to record this uh, earlier, yesterday. And every time I sit down to record this game, something goes wrong. It's like a bad omen. I probably shouldn't be playing this game, but I'm trying again. I recorded for like an hour and 18 minutes into the recording, uh, OBS just abruptly stopped, stopped recording. So the audio recorded, but the gameplay didn't. So the video was pretty much screwed anyway. So I'm going to try again. I'm going to be going with the electrocution method this time. I was going to try the pool method, but when, when things become tedious, I just don't have the patience to keep going on with it. So I've just, until I learn everything, until I figure out where everything is and how to do everything properly and, and develop a nice flow with this game, I'm just going to use the easier elimination methods. I'm not going to go for the difficult ones that have like an a thousand step plan and all these different items you need and all this I just don't have the patience for that. So we're going to go with the electrocution method for today's video. Leave a like if you enjoy. Let's hop straight in. So since I already bought it off camera with the info points, I'm assuming I already have the checklist here. Yes, I do. Obtain a screwdriver from the workshop on the second floor. What the hell was that? Did you, did you all hear that or was that just on my end? Audio went all fucked up for a second. Anyway, screwdriver from the workshop on the second floor. Here we go, here's the workshop and the screwdriver. <clears throat> oh shit, we need to hide this. Okay, now we need to obtain a power strip from the audio visual room on the third floor. <coughs> the audio visual room, I almost ran past it, but here's the power strip. And I don't believe that we get I don't believe we trigger people when we, when we, um, I don't believe this triggers the other students when they see us walking around with this thing. So we should be fine what to just stand out in the open with it here. Plug the power strip into the power outlet in the east third floor girls bathroom. So this is the west and this is the east. So right here we need to put this, we need to plug it in here. No one's here to watch us thankfully. Use a screwdriver to sabotage the power outlet. So let's do that Q to sabotage. Yeah, boy. I just pressed the wrong thing. Uh, put that away before someone spots us through the what wall. Do you need Obtain a pipe wrench from the pump room underneath the school pool. Now I know where that is from the last elimination method. I'm pretty sure I had to go down there or I was just down there for one reason or another. So I have a rough idea of where to go get that. So if I'm not mistaken, it's this room right here. Oh, absolutely. Pipe branch. Now this, this, this part is sand in my ass because you can't even like put it away. You have to sneak it over there without anyone seeing you. And this is where most of my attempts have screwed over and they're gonna see me from across the planet. Okay. Oh shit. We have to get all the way up to the third floor as well. That's bullshit. Oh, please. Oh no, that person's there. Okay. Woo! Okay. Is this the third floor? Yeah, that's the roof up there. So this is the third floor here. So we might be already here without, s without triggering anyone. Okay, this, that's the luckiest, that's the luckiest run I've had. I, I tried this earlier and it didn't work like that. I got super frustrated. And it took ages, but we, we finally managed to, we actually managed to get here without too much problem now. Um, I believe we... What do you use the pipe wrench to create a leak next to the sabotage power strip. Create leak right there. And we put this down. Acquire emetic poison. There is a scheme that explains how to do so. I believe I Don't have the flower on my head, so I don't think I'm in the gardening club anymore But all you have to do is you just have to go back to that Gardening club and join the gardening club then you get access to the shed that has the emetic poison in it The only problem is I don't exactly know where it is 
It's, I know it's out here somewhere. I'm really shocked at how easy it was to get the pipe wrench up there to the to the bathroom. It was never that easy before. I must. Oh, we can just pickpocket, but I don't want to wish. I don't want to risk anything. Oh, hello, dear. Welcome. Would you like to join us? Uh, except. Oh, wonderful! You're a member of the gardening club now. This lady's on the same stuff that Rybrew is on. Listen to the way she talks. No one talks like that. What the fuck? Anyway, we need the poison. Emetic rat poison. Which apparently is emetic poison. Okay. So hold on, I forgot what the step- what do you Okay. Acquire emetic poison. Put a medic poison into the pink bento on Osana's desk. See, this this part's unfair because the, these 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 assholes are sitting here. What the hell? No, someone is watching. However, much raging later, after much raging, I found out that they they go to their seats at eight o'clock. So we're just going to skip time till eight o'clock. It's probably good that the first attempt at this didn't record properly because it was just a bunch of me complaining and raging which wouldn't have been good to watch so at least this way things can flow a lot smoother and you actually get some commentary rather than just raging because this just this part here took me like 20 minutes I was just pacing up and down the hallway running around the classroom waiting for these guys to piss off and it was just it was it was not it was not fun it was not nice Okay, we just need to wait for them. To oh, this this person will always see me. I'm just gonna do it. What the hell? What? I'm about to rage again. How am I supposed to do this if they're gonna just sit there? Because we have to get this done before 8:30. That's the deadline here. It, it let me do it last time. I don't know why it's not letting me do it this time. Maybe I have to wait for this person. Do they get up and leave? Maybe. It let me do this last time. No, people are coming into the classroom. How am I able to do this? How am I supposed to do this? If people are going to see me. What? Okay, now it's randomly letting me do it now. And no one's watching. That was really random. <laughs> okay, but it did let us do it, thankfully. And now what are we what doing? Do you now it says, wait until Osana eats the bento at lunchtime. So I guess we just pass time by going to class. I don't think there's any specific stat we need to improve. So I'm just going to put it here. What? Oh. I got confused. Okay. So she's going to take this to the roof and eat it. Okay, Osana. It's time. Hmm. What the fuck is your problem? I literally do nothing and these people sit there and they just stand there menacingly. Okay, someone's noticed the wrench in the bathroom. That's fine, we don't need it anymore. How come I get busted for having stuff in my hand which isn't even a weapon, it's just a wrench? But other students pick it up and they're completely fine. They get to walk past, they get to rub it in the teacher's faces and they don't do anything I really do hope I didn't accidentally put it in the wrong one we only want the best for senpai we don't want him to shit himself or vomit all over Here. himself what's this it's a bento stupid you made me lunch don't get the wrong idea I didn't make it for you I just made too much food this morning so you can have the extras oh Cool. Thanks a lot. Just shut up and eat it. I've said it once and I'll say it again. Senpai is bitch made. Why is he taking this disrespect from Osana? Wow. This is delicious. Really? You, you like it, Senpai? Yeah, it's great. That's right. You should be great. But don't expect me to keep giving you free food. And unless you... You want to eat my cooking every day. Huh? Well, 
was that? I, I didn't say anything. Dummy. There's no way he didn't hear that. I'm over here and I heard that. Okay, finally. And now she's going to get a strange feeling in her stomach. Where, where's Raibaru? Is she going to follow us and like... Okay, she's not going to follow us to the bathroom. Which is cool. I'm telling you, man, she's on all kinds of performance enhancing substances right there. If she finds out that we're the one that poisoned Asana and tried to kill her, she would just pick us up and throw us or something. She is not in her right mind. Okay. So we wait for her to wash her hands. <laughs> we wait for her to wash her hands and then we turn off the light switch. Now, even though these people are right here, they have no way of proving that it was me. <laughs> they just carry on talking. <laughs> I'm just gonna get out of here. I am getting the fuck out of here. We might be screwed because these student council members are suspicious of us, even when we're just standing there picking our nose. Now, it says the police are coming, and we haven't disposed of the corpse, but... There's no- there's nothing linking us to the crime, so we're just gonna pass time and wait for them to get their asses over here. Surprisingly, my reputation didn't even drop either. No one caught me doing anything suspicious. But anyway, the police arrive at school. The police discover the corpse of Osana Najimi. The police are unable to locate any murder weapons. The police question all students in the school, including Ayano. The police are unable to link Ayano to any crimes. <laughs> yes. The police do not have enough evidence to perform an arrest. The police investigation ends and students are free to leave. Senpai is absolutely devastated by the death of his childhood friend. His mental, his mental stability has been greatly affected. Senpai will stay home from school for one day to mourn her death. Ayano returns home, thinking of Senpai every step of the way. You just caused him emotional damage. And she gives zero fucks. And that, my friends, is the electrocution elimination method. Of course, if you enjoyed the video, leave a like and subscribe to the channel. And I will see you later.